Hello there YouTube. I've been asked to do a freeze test with the Kangen water. So I'm going to do a freeze test with the 9.5 Kangen water and then the 8.5 Kangen water. So I have two glasses here. Two glasses. Nothing in them, they've been cleaned, so there can't be any sediment or anything in there, or salts, or calcium, or anything. And uh, I'm gonna, I'm gonna get my thermometer. I got the thermometer. I'm gonna get my thermometer. So we're gonna do, Water, 9.5. 9.5 in that glass. And we're going to do 8.5 in this glass. Temperatures 59.5. Well, that's because the sink is going up, but you get the idea. So they're at a little bit below room temperature. I'm going to pause the video, I'm going to put them in the freezer. Actually, I'll put them in the freezer on video so you can't say I switched the water. Let me take it over here. Right here, here's the freezer. Putting them in there. Okay. Then pause the video and I'll bring it back when it All right. It's been about two hours. I'm going to take the water out. As you can see, Totally frozen. Put them up here. Now this is because there's frost on the outside, but I'll let it thaw for just a little bit to let the outside be frost. I took a hot rag and I wiped them down. So this is what we got from the freeze test. Now mind you that the Kangen system does not remove calcium and minerals from the water. All it does is ionizes the water. So it, cha it changes it electrically, but it doesn't remove and, and this is well water that that we're uh, we're using here, so it's it's high in calcium. So you can see that there might have been some that settled down to the bottom, but in the middle, middle they're kind of clear. All right. Well, that's the freeze test. Thanks for watching.